the MB Tech here. Um, so as you all know, some of my videos I did um what looks similar to the screen flow effect. Um, now I use Caden Live for that. I did do a video on how to do that effect in OpenShot. Um, you can go on my channel and watch that video if you would like. But Caden Live to me is more simple how to do it. So first you need to open up Caden Live. First choose the two videos that you want. And once you choose the videos, I'm just going to choose these two random videos that I have right here. Um, they're both are music videos, but you're probably going to want to do these with tutorials that you're you're doing for YouTube or whatever site. I'm just going to drag the two videos in there. Okay. And we're going to put both of these video files inside of track 1 and track 2. Okay. All right. Now, um, so for our top video, I'm gonna zoom in. For our top video, we're gonna click on it. We're gonna right click, and we're gonna click Add Transition. Now, this is where the video over video effect comes in. You're gonna choose Composite, and you should get that transition right there. Now, clicking on that transition up here in the transition window, you should get this right here. This allows you to make your video smaller this is um really the video over video thing right here because once you move your video over you can see that that video over here is now on top of that um so that's basically you can move it around um that's basically how to get the video over video effect um simple very simple simpler than how to do it in open shot um, in case you all didn't understand in that video, um, Caden Live, yes, it crashes a, a few times, but to me, it's the best video editor in Linux that I've used. Um, there are others. Well, the MB Tech here, and peace. See you later.